Hello my friends, it's Jason Stevenson here from Life Expansion and welcome and it's not a live video today but I promise I will be back next week to do a live video but I'm here to make this a short one specifically to announce the winners of last week's competition and to let you in on a little bit of what I'm doing this week and I'm inviting you to come along with me so first of all the winners of last week's the biology of belief contest uh, that win the Bruce Lipton book are the following people Blah, drum roll blah. okay we have Christina Ibanez Anne Astrop Zoe Sullivan Jeff Robidu and Jane Medenhall all of you guys Christina Ibanez Anne Astrop Zoe Sullivan, Jeff Robidoux, and Jane Medenhall, you've all won yourself the Biology of Belief book by uh, Dr. Bruce Lipton. Amazing, life-changing stuff. It will be coming your way if you contact me at um, admin at relaxmeonline.com. That's admin at relaxmeonline.com. And put in the subject heading winner of Jason's competition so if you can put winner of Jason's competition in the subject heading and then inside put your name and mailing address that's most important okay we need your mailing address so we can get these books to you congratulations and congratulations to all who entered thank you very much for your support and I invite you this week to come along on I guess you would call it a little quantum journey with me what I'm doing this week is uh, beginning today. I've already begun. I've been doing it the last few days, but for all of this week, I'm doing a five minutes meditation practice. This is just at home. This is on your own at home. Five minutes of meditation practice, of mindfulness meditation, of just being still and connecting to your breath and allowing any thoughts to come and go without judgment without trying to push them away, whatever it is, just being still and recognizing that there's thoughts coming and going and then just going back to focusing on your breathing, no matter how many times you have to go back to your breath, just for about five minutes. Begin your day with that and following straight after that, five minutes of consciousness, conscious deliberate intention of creating the life of your dreams in the areas of health, wealth and happiness. So what I want you to do in this is just close your eyes and see yourself, see your body as you would like it to be and, and feel, feel your body as you would like it to be. Feel what it's like to be there now. This is the process of deliberate intention and when you get the feeling aligned with the thought, it brings a powerful resonance out there and sends rockets to the moon. Okay, so do that for anything to do with the health of your body. You might have pain, you might have an illness you want relieved or sickness or dis-ease of the body, whatever it is. Okay, see all those cells repairing. Once you've done that, we move on to wealth. And this doesn't just have to be, it doesn't have to be just financial wealth. You can align it to whatever you want it to be like. Wealth, it can be financial wealth, it can be wealth of uh, love, wealth of compassion, a wealth of um, whatever it is you choose. I'm choosing financial because in the next section, happiness uh, is that health, wealth and happiness, then happiness it's focusing for a few minutes on how you see your life to unfold, how you want it to unfold, and to really feel that joy bubbling up inside you. And I want you to do this for, do it for the next seven days. Keep it going. And then we can check in and we can talk about it when I come back in on the live presentation the following week. Um, and what I want you to do, guys, is to keep your eyes out for, as Joe, Dr. Joe Dispenser says, quantum surprises. And you can ask the universe to give you little ideas that they are receiving your messages. OK, 
okay, that you're sending out there, the particles in the field of consciousness, and ask, okay, please give me a sign of uh, if you're receiving this message and keep your eye out for quantum surprises. Watch little miracles day by day that can unfold, that actually can happen, and you will be surprised beyond belief because they begin to take shape as soon as we begin to be deliberate about how we want our life to unfold. So remember guys, this is not woo woo, this is now science. We are energy, right down to the subatomic particle inside that, it's only energy. And so because of that, there's just mind and matter are one and the same thing, interchangeable. We've been deceived for so a long time just thinking it matters the only thing and mind's something separate. And now it's time to align them both and to begin to be a conscious creator, consciousness creator or creator of consciousness. Do it, do it with me. And we can talk about it. I'll have a chat with you guys about, I would love to see if there's any stories about how things are going for you. So just five minutes if you can, of mindfulness of sitting there watching your breath and you can begin that by taking in I normally take in three deep breaths and um, blow out let go of tension it helps me to just bring me to settle me down then from that point on I just breathe in and out through the nose at a calm comfortable rhythm just in and out and in and out and then just observing thoughts sounds feelings, sensations that come and go without judgment, allowing all that takes place to just take place in the palm of your hand, just, just like you're witnessing it in the palm of your hand. And then after you've done that, create the life, create your life, see your life. And remember, once you've created this, um, you can do the same thing for five, six days, or you can do it one different thing each day if you choose to. There's no hard and fast rules. These are the things that I'm telling you. There's no hard and fast rules in this. The only thing is, is, is to feel it and to think it at the same time. Get that feeling that it's there, that it's present, because it is. Because it is. There is no past, present, and future. It is all one interchangeable, beautiful field that we can shape shift and manifest to our desires. And I really look forward to talking to you about this next week uh, because there's a few things that I want to share with you that some may say only small things, but I've been blown out by what has been happening. And I'm excited to share them with you next week on a live session. So for now, guys, I send you love. I congratulate the winners. I'll say them one more time. Christina Ibanez, Anne Astrop, Zoe Sullivan, Jeff Robert Do, Dow, Robert Do or Robert Dow, and Jane Medenhall. Congratulations, guys. And I, I love all you guys. I send infinite love at this very moment to you out there. God bless. Namaste.